A meeting today at Greenfield Community College to examine how to create sober housing. The discussion was a joint effort by the North Quabbin Community Coalition and Opioid Task Force of Franklin County. An important step towards helping those who are affected by substance use disorders recover in a safe, healthy living environment. The number of certified sober homes in Western Massachusetts is only 10, and there's a strong need for more from established providers to match certified private housing owners. Sober housing creates opportunities for people that may not have been successful otherwise. That they get peer support, they get real everyday support to be the people that they want to be. Nearly another half dozen of sober homes are needed in the area, and those without an income residing in sober homes are not expected to pay. Those with Social Security disability income will pay one third of their income. Further information can be found on WWLP.com.